Why? Hello and welcome everybody. Also, happy holidays. I hope you guys enjoyed the weekend and everything. So, uh, we actually finished up in Trade League a little bit ago. So, I ended up getting level 100, did some Ubers, you know, did pretty much majority of all the content, did a couple of full Sanctum clears. And, you know, I had fun with Trade League, but I'm taking a break from it. So, we're going to be starting the SSF playthrough now. Uh, I have played for about a day. We're about level 80 right now, and I kind of wanted to walk you guys through my progression, what I'm doing, etc. Um, of course, for the people who want to see the lower level gameplay, you can also just go watch my VOD on Twitch. You'll see me leveling extremely inefficiently. Um, all right, yeah, but let's get started. So the character is level 81. I'm just going to go over my gear and kind of what I'm doing. So this is a weapon I picked up off the floor. So I was just identifying blue scepter bases on my filter, ended up getting a fire multi scepter, and then just crafted fire damage. And then I regal trying to get something, didn't get anything. This is currently where my frost blink flammability setup is. Uh, in our helmet, we are using an honor home just because it gives plus two socket gem. And here I have my elemental focus, efficacy, righteous fire, and burning damage support. So that's RF. I uh, ended up getting a Saffles Frame off of my first map, uh, kind of crazy. Not really very good to use Saffles Frame with this low of armor right now, especially because I do not have Unbreakable yet, but nonetheless, it's our best shield we're going to get, so we're just immediately slapping it on and using it. This is where I currently have my faster attack set up. I would prefer it in a different spot so I could life tap my Infernal Cry. Uh, in my boots here, I've got Fire Trap with... Uh, what is it? I can't see. Life tap, trap and mine, and combustion. Uh, in my gloves, I have the arrogance vitality setup with Skitterbot. Um, then in my body armor, I'm currently using Infernal Cry, Stone Golem, leveling an extra fire trap. I've got Molten Shell, Purity of Elements, and Determination. And you can pretty much see all my gear. Nothing is really that crazy. I'd say with the exception of getting like the Saffles frame and the Pyre Ring, and I ding. A body armor like this which still also isn't that crazy we're doing pretty good um our passive tree looks pretty normal so i cannot use malevolence yet as i do not have a mana reservation efficiency jewel that will most likely go right here uh and looks like we are now moving towards i want to say heart of flame and breath of flame and we are level 81 all right let me go ahead and run my one of my higher tier maps. I actually haven't even done yellow tier maps on this character yet. Let's do an iceberg. Ooh, monsters have Ellie res. This is going to take like 20 minutes to clear. Let's go. So right now with my Atlas, um, this is pretty much what I do every league. I grab focused investigation. I grab covert stakeouts and then my goal is to fill out bribery and effective leadership and then I start using my master missions to try to get unveiled gear. Um, other than that, I will work on getting the shaping the skies node and then potentially shaping the valley and shaping the seas. I cannot do this yet. Oh my god, I'm so slow. Dude. I'm so slow. What's the movement speed roll in my boots? 25. Oof, that's boopy. I guess to be fair, Glorious Plate doesn't reduce your movement speed by 5% like most body armor, so getting a Glorious Plate is uh, a big goal for me. Good find, oh, I need to go defer the Sanctum. Not defer, whatever it's called. Stack it up, stack it up. Am I drunk? Oh, here it is. Yes. 
So we're pretty weak against elemental damage until we get our unbreakable ascendancy. But we should be fine here. Just take a minute to kill the boss. Ooh, never mind. Okay. Don't stand still. Got it. Not a jug until we ascend. Perfect. Yep, so that's pretty much the character. Um, kind of showing a little bit of gear that I've unveiled that I kind of want to use. I guess there's not much. There's really just these boots. They're uh, dual res boots with movement speed onslaught on kill. Would make mapping a lot faster. I just have to like socket them and color them, which really isn't a problem. So these are probably the boots we're going to use. Other than that, that's really about it. I found this amulet, but it's not really very amazing. Yep, anyway, that's pretty much about it. So, hope you guys had a wonderful time. Hope you guys enjoyed yourselves. I do have a couple of videos planned to put out. It's just I haven't had the time to make them since they do kind of want me to showcase some stuff that just is very time consuming. One of them is like why players are dying in red tier maps. And spoiler, it comes down to not reading things like altars, map mods, and expedition. But anyway, that's pretty much about it. So, hope you guys had a wonderful time. Hope you guys enjoyed yourselves. Happy holidays again. And I'll see you guys all tomorrow. Take care, everybody.